Shalom, shalom, shalom. The Lord is good and His mercy is endures forever. So this verse says, But I discipline my body and bring it into subjection, lest when I have preached to others, I myself should become disqualified. More like a question. First Corinthians 9.27, I've just read. This is Apostle Paul who was saved by the Lord Yeshua. So this man is not an hypocrite. He was genuinely saved. He's not one of the Matthew 23 pastors. And like Esther Sapphoro's testimony on how she was called out of worldliness to holiness. But why has she gone back on her vomit is the question many are wondering. And because of that, some who are not even near holiness think they have the audacity to judge that she was fake. No, I don't think so. The word of God says in 1 Corinthians 9 that even Apostle Paul is not like the egoistic pastors of today who boast about being in heaven. He was saved by the Lord Yeshua and still praying that not after preaching to others, Will it be a castaway? That means you can be saved by the Lord Yeshua. You can preach to others and still be a castaway. If you refuse to set yourself apart unto holiness to God. If not, if you go back to those who are yet to be holy, evil communications with them will corrupt your own holiness. 1 Corinthians 15.33 So let's keep praying for Esther Sapphoro. And ourselves, Jude chapter 1, 24 to 25.